find a way to take a seat down, open your knees, place your torso between your knees and try to place your head on your feet. Relax your neck, relax your shoulders, relax your arms and your hands, relax your back. Slowly roll up. Now gently twist to your left. Try to extend your back. Pull your shoulders down. Take a look backward. Observe your body, observe your breath. Keep breathing slowly and deeply with your abdominal muscles. And then switch your sides. Again, take a look backward. Try to find 90 degrees in your torso. Try to keep your ribs inside. Don't arch your back. And again, observe your body. Okay, then again, center. Try to place your feet now inside. And then gently pull yourself down. Again, relax your neck, relax your back. Gently open your hips. Keep breathing slowly. Now slowly again roll up and then move your feet forward, hands up, dandasana, and then exhale. Paschimatanasana. If you need, you can gently bend your knees and try to place your chest down on your knees. Flex your feet. Try to extend your lower back. And now inhale, grow up, and then bring your hands down. Find a way to move forward, and then take Shashankasana. Torso again between your knees. Hands forward. Observe your body, observe your breath. And now inhale, grow up, flex your feet, push your pelvis up, Adha Mukha Svanasana, try to extend your knees, extend your back, and you can relax your neck, and then exhale, move your pelvis down plank, inhale, move your, push your pelvis up, bend your knees, try to place your stomach down on your knees, and then again, inhale, extend your knees. Exhale, bring your pelvis down. Inhale, move up. Exhale, bend your knees. Inhale, extend your knees. And then again, bring your pelvis down, plank. And then move up. Observe your body, observe your breath. Bend your knees, stomach down on your knees. And extend your knees. Again, plank. Move up, inhale. And then exhale. Now place your knees down on the floor. Try to keep your knees under your hips. 
and then place your chest and your chin down. Take a look forward. If it's too difficult, you can use your hands. You, uh, flex your feet, move your torso slightly forward. Okay, so find your option here. If you need to, you can use your blocks. You can place your blocks under your chest and your chin. And then open your chest. Arch your back. Keep breathing with your abdominal muscles. Now from here, grow up, hands under your shoulders, and then curve your chest, contract your abdominal, chin on your chest. And also you can move forward and then backwards, stretch out your back now. Again, forward and then backward and forward and backward. forward backward and then slowly roll up place your hands under your lower back and then again arch your back open your chest up take a look up be careful with your neck okay and then slowly Calm down, again take a seat down, Shashankasana, torso between your knees. Keep breathing slowly and deeply. Hands in front and relax your neck, relax your back. Keep breathing slowly. Observe your breath, observe your body. Now uh, roll up. Take a seat down on your heels and then spread out your hands. Now right arm in front, bend your left elbow and then pull your right arm closer to your chest. Gently stretch out your shoulder. Try to move your shoulders down, long, long neck. Move your tailbone down. Again, try to extend your back, don't arch your back and keep your ribs inside. Okay, now inhale again, spread out your hands, more energy to your fingers, and then switch your arms. Again, pull your shoulders down. Try to keep your ribs inside, keep breathing with your abdominal. Move your tailbone down. More energy to your fingers. Long neck. Good. Now from here, move your hands up, inhale slightly, arch your back, take a look up. And then Namaste front. Move forward. And then again, Adha Mukha Svanasana. Extend your knees, extend your back. And then bend your right knee, shift your weight forward. Try to touch the head with your knee. Okay, and then from here, switch, exhale. And then again, move up. Exhale, shift your weight forward. And then pelvis up, feet down. And then again, move forward. And then down. Okay, bend your knees. And then from here, extend your knees. Then move your right foot up. Try to square your hips and square your shoulders. Push your heel up. Spread out your fingers. Now open your hips. Strong legs. Extend your knees. Then bend your right knee. Shift your weight forward. Step forward. Hands on the floor. And then extend your left knee. If you need, you can bring your knee down. Okay, then open your chest, hands on your right knee. And then move your hands up, 
Try to arch your back. Open your chest. Take a look up. Good. And from here, bring your elbows down on the floor. Relax your neck. If you need, you can use your blocks. If you have blocks, and then you can place your elbows down on your blocks. Relax your neck. If you want to challenge yourself, then you can hug your right leg. Okay, and then also relax your neck. And then relax. Observe your body, observe your breath. Keep breathing slowly and deeply. And now keep your left elbow on the floor, bring your right hand up. If you can extend your left knee, gently twist and try to keep your chest closer to your knee. Take a look up. Now bring your hands down and then from here move your weight backward. You can flex your left foot and take it down on your heel. Extend your right knee, bring your torso down. Uh, if it's too difficult, you can use your blocks or you can use any pillows. Take it down on your blocks or the pillows you have. And then finally, if you want to challenge yourself, you can point your left foot and then take a sit down on your heel and then calm down deeper. Flex your right foot and gently pull your foot inside and again observe. Be an observer. Observe the sounds around you, observe your body. Keep breathing slowly and deeply. Now from here move forward, so move your blocks away and then twist, bring your left knee inside. Take a look backward through your right shoulder. Try to again extend your back. If you want to challenge, try to catch your left hand behind. Again, shoulders down. To long, long neck. Keep breathing slowly and deeply. Good. Now from here move. Move your left foot backward again. Keep your hands on the floor. And now circle with your right hand. Move your hand down. And then extend your right knee. Keep your left hip heel up. If you need to use your blocks, place your hands down on your blocks. Exhale, pelvis down. Again, inhale, extend your knee. Try to place your chest down on your knee. And then again, exhale. Inhale. Move it up. And then exhale, bring it down. Now open the chest. Again, arch your back, take a look up. And then exhale, 
hands down on the floor, shift your right foot up again. Take a look forward, shift your weight backward or down, slide forward, shoulders down, open the chest, Udha Mukhvashvanasana. And then move your pelvis up, Adha Mukhvashvanasana. Okay, and then again plank. Inhale, move up. And now bend your knees, place your chest down on your knees. Inhale. Move your left foot up again, try to square your hips and square your shoulders. Spread out your fingers. And then open the hips. Point your left foot. Okay, then bend the knee. Curve your chest. Step. And now from here, open the chest. Keep your hands on your knee. Okay, then if you can move your hands high, again arch your back, take a look up. And then exhale again, place your elbows down on the floor. Again, if you need, if you want, try to hug your leg. If you need, use your blocks, place your elbows down on your blocks. And then again, be an observer. Observe the sounds, observe your breath, observe your body. Keep breathing slowly and deeply. Okay, now try to extend your right knee, then bring your left hand up and twist. Try to keep your knee closer to your chest. Okay, and then bring your knee down and then shift your weight backwards. Again, you can take a sit down on your heel, flex your right foot and then relax. If you need, you can use your blocks. And if you want, just take a sit down on your heel. So find your option here. Also, you can use any pillows if you have. Try to meditate in every asana. Good, now from here gently move forward, right knee inside, twist, take a look backward through your left shoulder, if you want try to take finger slope behind and again check your shoulders, move your shoulders down, low neck, keep breathing slowly. Ok, 
gently and then move your right foot again backward, hands on the floor if you need to use your blocks. A circle with your left hand first, watch your hand, bring your hands down and then extend your knee. Keep your right heel up and again try to square your hips. Then gently move down. Again inhale. And then exhale. Inhale. Exhale. Move your torso up. Inhale. Open the chest again. Arch your back. Take a look up. And then move your hands down. Okay, then left foot up. Open the hips. Then take a look forward, shift your weight forward. Chaturanga. Slide. Urdhva Mukha Svanasana. Open the chest, shoulders down, long, long neck. Good. Now from here, bring your pelvis up. Take a look forward, bend your knees and then jump or two steps. Try to place your hands down on the floor. If you need, you can use your blocks. You can place your hands down on your blocks. Relax your neck. And then also, if you want, if you can, try to hug your legs. Take elbow slog. Try to shift your weight slightly forward on your toes. Feel your weight on your toes. Now bend your knees, flat your back, bring your hands forward, open your palms up. Now exhale, step backward with your right foot, keep your feet onto parallel lines. Relax your neck, so now heels on the floor. Then if you need, you can use your block. You can place your right hand down on your block or keep it in on the floor. And then open the chest, bring your left hand up. Take a look up. Try to twist. Keep breathing slowly. Okay, then move your left hand down. Now shift your weight forward, bring your right foot up. If you need to use your blocks, you can place your hands down on your blocks. If you can move your hands forward, then open your chest and then take a look up, Ardha Chandrasana. Keep breathing slowly and deeply. Move down. And again, relax. Now again, bend your knees, exhale, extend your back, hands forward, extend your knees. And then exhale, now step backward with your left foot, keep your feet into parallel lines. Try to square your hips, square your shoulders. Again, if you need to use your block. Now from here, move your right hand forward, extend your back first. Then open the chest, take a look up. Try to extend your back, long, long neck. To 
again observe your body, observe your breath. Now move your right hand down and then shift your weight forward, left foot up. If you need to use your blocks, you can keep your hands down on your blocks. We'll try to move your hands forward. Okay, then open the chest. Again, Ardha Chandrasana. Find the balance here. Try to take a look up. Open your hips as much as you can. Okay, then release, bend your knee. Bring, uh, place your feet down on the floor. If you want, again, you can hug your legs. And keep breathing slowly and deeply. You now place your hands down, take a look slightly forward, and then try to place your knees into your armpits. Shift your weight forward, Bakasana. If it's too difficult, you can use your block. Place your feet down on your block, bring your pelvis high, you can bend your elbows. In preparation for Bakasana. Feel your weight in your arms. Take a look forward. And then also if you want to challenge yourself, try to bring your feet up, pelvis up. Bend your knees. Okay, try several times. Okay, then bend your knees. Flat, flat your back and then again calm down, bend the knees from here, jump or two steps backward, Chaturanga, slide forward, Urha Mukha Svanasana, shoulders down, long neck, move your chest slightly forward and up and then Adha Mukha Svanasana, calm down, Bend your knees and again Shashankasana, take a rest. Okay. If you're tired, you can take Shavasana here, take a rest. If you want, you can continue your practice with any other video.